wandering in circles outside a museum in Seoul with their eyes glued to their phones. It's a scene reminiscent of the Pokemon Go craze, when gamers flooded the streets to catch characters using the mobile phones. But these people are instead collecting pocket money by tapping these icons on the online banking app TOSS. The app, developed by South Korean startup Viva Republica and launched in January, gives out micropayments after users complete certain tasks, such as walking a set amount of steps a day or answering simple questions to train artificial intelligence. For the company, it is a way to increase engagement, but for many people, it's a new source of income amid soaring inflation and high youth unemployment. Prices have risen sharply, so I'm using this online banking app to help me earn money, even if it's a little, and it's also good to take a walk like this. That's why I'm doing this. Consumer inflation in South Korea hit 5.1 percent last year, the highest jump in 25 years. Food prices were up by about 6 percent, and transport skyrocketed by nearly 10 percent. Currently, I have collected about a dollar and 20 cents for about a month and a half. It's also good to go out and take a walk by using this service. I'm planning to collect about three to three dollars and 75 cents to get a cup of coffee. Toss is not the only app in the market offering these rewards, but it is the most prominent. A recent survey by a local job portal found that as many as 75 percent of South Korean adults engage in such activities. It may earn you some pennies, but some experts are sounding caution that it may come at the expense of your privacy.